Hey guys, what's going on today? Bojo here, and I'm going to be bringing you guys a, another Hockey Ultimate Team team update number three. So, this past weekend was very fortunate. They came out with another double pucks weekend. And the first thing I need to show you guys is look in the top right corner at my EA pucks total. Holy crap, That that is the most amount of pucks that I have actually earned in any NHL game, hut game, whatever, 300, and really, I'll just round it off, 311,000 pucks. That is a ridiculous puck amount for me. I I don't even know what to uh, spend it on, but that's where you guys are definitely going to come in here. So this team, this team, hut, uh, this hut team update, I'm going to need your guys' help because I'm not really so sure as to who I should buy. Or if you guys should think I should just keep my team intact together because I did I do like this team, and uh, recently I played the online elite invitational tournament and I probably played the best. I always seem to choke during the playoffs come during the playoffs and I always choke in the finals. But this one I played four consistent great games of hockey in a row, the best four games of hockey I played in a row, and it was just awesome what I did with this team. So let's go check these guys out and see what changes I've made to this team. So now I've definitely changed up the first line. So pretty much uh, defense and goalie are pretty much the same. But right now on my first line, I'm just waiting until the market goes down, then I'll buy these uh, change team cards as they come. So now on my first line, for right now, I've got Patrick Marlowe, Joe Thornton, and Martin Havlat, so it's all San Jose first line now. I really like this. Thornton, Thornton's checking ability is absolutely amazing. I love him there. And like I said, still the same guys on defense with Matt Carl and Nick Letty with Carey Price in the net. So first line's looking pretty good. Second line, uh, different change it up here as well. We got now an Anaheim Ducks second line. So we got Bobby Ryan, Ryan Getzlav, and Corey Perry for our second line here. Once again, some more guys who can lay the body down. I tried to look out for uh, some, some guys who have really good shots, are somewhat quick, and also can lay the body down. That's It's really what I wanted on my team. The last team update, they were good. They were nice and quick, but I had nobody really on my team that could really like check. So that's why I wanted to get some checkers on my team with some good shot shooting abilities as well. So these guys are pretty good. And they eat, then they are pretty fast. I mean, Corey Perry, Bobby Ryan, and Ryan Getzloff are pretty fast, they seem, for 85 skating still. So I'm very happy with them. And then, obviously, the second line, we got Team of the Week, uh, Jason Garrison and Kevin Bieksa on the second pair for the defense. So that's cool there. Third line, we still got the LA Kings lineup. I switched out Logan Couture and inserted Simone Gagne in there. So now it's really a uh, a really old school Flyers lineup right here. So we got, even though Simone Gagne is back on the Flyers, but still it's awesome. So we got Simone Gagne, Mike Richards, and Jeff Carter. And then I recently picked up in a trade, I acquired a Patrick Kane, and I traded him away for a Team of the Week Vishnovsky, Parento, and a Martin St. Louis. So that was before the market got all screwed up by the double pucks and the packs that all came out. But still, it was a really good deal on my part. So I got Team of the Week, Lubavir, Vishnovsky, and I sold my Eric Carlson just because uh, Vishnovsky had better stats than Carlson. And uh, Carlson's really just a name, and that's thirty-five grand just sitting in my sitting on my team where I can just sell that away. So him and Paul Martin are together there. So. That's the third line. And on the fourth line, like I said, we're still trying to work out what we want on the third line on the fourth line here. Right now I got Martin uh Michael Grabner, John Tavares, and Martin St. Louis for the fourth line. We're still trying to figure it out. Because if I can get if I I know I have a three hundred and eleven thousand pucks, if I can get a really good like superstar stud lineup, pretty much everybody moves down the line. Except I would probably put Gagne, Richards, and Carter on the second line and move these these guys down to the fourth line where I could have a really nice grindy ass fourth line on there and just keep these guys on the third line for the speedsters. But I don't know. Tell me, uh, let me know what you guys think about this. Uh, the third line and the fourth line are definitely the biggest questions. I I think you got most of you guys would agree that you would want to keep. Marlowe, Thornton, Havlat, Perry, Getzlav, and Bobby Ryan. I mean, those guys are all around 86, 87s around there, and they're really good high-end players. But 
The third line, I don't know. I want to keep Gagne because he's got the good speed, and I just like this lineup. I mean, it just brings back some good memories of the Flyers team, and just having them all with LA Kings is just, you know, it's just a slap in the face, I guess. But this fourth line definitely needs some work here. So eventually all these guys will be gone. There's, I mean, Tavares and St. Louis and Grabner are all really good players, but uh, they are, they're probably going to be replaced with the superstar studs that I'm eventually going to buy. So you guys have to let me know. What do you think my team actually needs right now? So I'll just show you guys these again. We got the San Jose line, uh, two really good fast guys in Marlowe and Havlat and a really good checker in Thornton. And both, all three of them have a pretty good, decent shot in hands. Uh, our second line, Ryan, Getzlav, and Perry. Obviously, this is the, it's the really good checking line with, with uh, really good, decent shots in there. So I want to keep them. Gagne, Richards, and Carter. Um, somewhat balanced speed everywhere, and uh, just some good memories there. All three of them could play decent defense. And then on the fourth line, yeah, we know we're going to change this up here. So let me know what you guys think I need on my team. What uh, Suggest some players in the comments area. That would be, um, that'd be awesome because, like I said, I got 310000 bucks to spend. I definitely can use uh, go and splurge a little bit as need be, so... Uh, yeah, that should be cool. Uh, cool. Let me know. Uh, but I'm not buying packs. Screw packs. I can't. I'm just the unluckiest person in the world. I'm not buying packs. It's end of question there. Not unless I get Microsoft points. I'm not going to be buying packs for you guys anymore. It's just, it's just crazy. My luck with this packs. I just don't get anything. So like I said, leave in the comment section about, uh, what you think my team needs. As always, hit the subscribe button. It always helps. And I will catch you guys next time for either Hut Team Update number 4 or gameplay. I gotta get gameplay out. I'm still not doing gameplay out, so hopefully I get some recording of that done. Catch you guys later.